Ito guys, no, another free to play mobile NFT RPG game na dapat makauna tayo. Ito ang Shatterpoint. Hi guys, I'm Jan AK Soral. Welcome to your YouTube channel for your NFT Playtime reviews. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Kaya, let's go! Ito guys, so yung website nila is shatterpoint.game at free to play blockchain action RPG game ito sa mobile skill based pa so sang ka pa di ba so ang maganda kasi dito makauna tayo dito sa mga ganitong kind of games na we can project na baka maging triple A game tapos free to play naman why not no follow their socials at kung nagfo-follow ka ng kanilang socials guys to meron silang parang giveaway no or campaign na first 10k members sa kanilang Discord community is magkakaroon ng special role pati guaranteed free gift ito po yung Discord nila ngayon from the recording of this video 2192 pa lang so meron pang mga less than 8000 na pag sumama dito is magkakaroon kayo ng role pati free gift at yung Discord nila, pati yung Twitter nila, kahit yung mga social sila ay nasa description below. Or pumunta man kayo sa ating Discord community, nandun din, ishinare ko ng maaga yung Discord invite link natin para makasama yung mga nasa community natin, pati mga viewers natin as well. Ang maganda pa dito, this is made by Block Games, okay? So, they are Team Docs, nandiyan naman yung team nila. Very visible at talagang studio talaga sila. They are also partnered by STOT. Yan po, yung third largest studio sa Europe guys. Ha? Kung titingnan nyo, ang dami nilang successful games as to date. 1.5 billion times the download at 250 million ang active monthly players dito sa STOT. So ito yung website nila for you to check kung ano yung mga ginawa nilang laro. Malay nyo, nilalaro nyo pala sa mga mobile devices to dyan. So, yan po. So, you can check na lang din po. So, syempre, tingnan natin ano ba yung i-offer sa atin itong Shatterpoint, no? Itong NFT game na free-to-play na to, which is RPG also. Sa kanilang website, nandito na may lore nila. So, we can expect na yung graphics na ating may kita dito sa ating mga mobile devices ay ganito. Okay, yan. So, may mga samples po sila ng kanilang laro. Yan, so may mga level na dyan, iba-iba yung avatar as well, maganda yung graphics at talagang pang mobile ang ginagawa nila. So nandito yung mga items as well, yun expect natin, and kung paano umatake, yung 3D na design nila, tapos pati pag nanalo ka daw, anong makukuha mo? Siyempre mga items, in-game items as well. So madami pagpipilian na warriors dito, no? yung Baynight. Shuei, Trevor, Shatusu, yan, Admira, Philly, Scofield. So, ito yung i-expect natin ng mga heroes dito. So, meron silang single player at meron din silang PvP arena battle mode na ilalabas in the future. Pati mga seasonal challenges as well. So, they are designed to be free to play kasi yun yung core philosophy nila. Para equal opportunity daw sa lahat ng players to craft an NFT at makapag-progress through the game. At the end of each season daw, no, mare-reset lahat ng non-NFT hero stats para mabigyan pa rin yung mga existing players ng advantage doon sa mga bagong players. They will keep yung mga runes, gears, and tokens sa laro. So take note, ang nare-reset is non-NFT hero. So yung mga hero NFT na yan is maaari hindi ma-reset. So yun pala yung advantage pag tayo ay bibili ng NFT nila. So yung mga game features sila, seasonal content, para may mga new challenges daw. So may mga NFT items. So this is a player-driven economy. Earn, trade, and sell in-game items. NFT yan in the marketplace. Tapos may mga forge din sila na pwede kang mag-upgrade ng hero NFT mo, pati mga equipment. May mga leaderboard para mapakita mo yung skills mo. Tapos syempre may mga reward as well. Yan, earn rewards, experience points, quantos, and equipment by hitting the top spots ng mga daily competition pati rewards pool. Tapos meron din silang sariling marketplace na pwede nyo i-trade yung mga hero NFTs. Pati yung mga makukuha yung runes at equipment dito sa larong ito. Pwede rin po mag-rent dito ng mga hero NFT at no risk. So, ito yung roadmap nila, no? 2022 quarter 1 pa, na-create yung kalilang community. Ngayon naman, 2022 quarter 2 na, 
we are expecting they will release their light paper soon kasi wala pa po silang light paper. Pati yung gameplay video nila, pati yung sale ng kanilang NFT heroes. Then, noong quarter 2, 2022, nandito na yung white paper release, cinematic trailer release, NFT sales ng mga runes, pati yung kanilang launch ng token na SHA. Then, on 2022, quarter 4, closed alpha po. Pati web marketplace launch. Then, next year, 2023, no? quarter 1, yung PVP 3 versus 3, pati QA testing po nila. Then, on quarter 2, 2023, open beta, more PVP modes, tapos may mga playable worlds na rin. Then, we can expect next year, around quarter 3 to quarter 4, yung kalalang full game launch. So, kung titingnan nyo, very early pa to, pero mas maganda makauna tayo dito by following their socials para meron tayong advantage sa mga late na makakapasok dito via their free gift as well. So, kindly take note guys, ha, yung mga AAA games na hindi pinapansin dati na may potential, kung titingnan nyo yung token nila ngayon is ang mahal-mahal na. Pati yung mga NFT nila is ang mahal-mahal na. Kaya it is best na tutukan natin no, yung mga early games na may potential like this para if ever nagustuhan natin yung tokenomics sila yung gameplay mismo na feeling natin we can enjoy it in the long run is win, super win na tayo doon sa ating investan or papasokan na laro. But remember guys, no, kahit na gustong gusto nyo at Bullish na bullish kayo sa isang investment or game. Just risk on a mod that you can afford to lose lang. And also, don't forget that this is an NFT game and you must enjoy it. Kaya, no, wag ka nang mag-isip at sumali sa kanilang Discord community sa ayong mga giveaway. So, ano sa tingin nyo guys? Comment down below. At kung gusto nyo pa ng mga ganitong contents, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hanggang sa muli guys. Baboo!